Hi, this is Daniel Nugent, Paint and Decorator. Uh, today is my first exterior job of this year and as you can see I'm doing this shiplap board in here and it's kind of like this is where it gets the sun so if you look at it closely it's really dried out it's really bad it hasn't been done in years so I just thought rather than giving it two coats of stain I'm going in solvent because I just think anything water-based just won't last so um, up here, I've made a start up here, and what I've done is I started off with a saddling classic because as you can see it's it's gone on nice. Um, it's a nice day today, so this will dry out kind of quite quick. Um, and the different there's a difference already. Um, and what I've done is I've used the classic because it, it's like a wood preserver, so it's gonna sink right in, right into the wood, into the open grain and then knots and stuff. And then after the classic, I will use a saddling extra, which is like a normal kind of exterior wood stain, satin finish, both in teak. Um, just, just as a top coat, um, because I just feel it, this needed something. I think if you just put stain straight on this, it ain't really gonna happen because it needs something to embed right in. So uh, yeah, so that's, that's a good little tip if you, if you wanna, if you've got real dried out wood, I would put the preserver on first and then the stain. A coat of each, that, that's probably all it needs. So it's a two coat job. Quite a bit of it to do on this house. And um, yeah, so here we go, it's the saddling, saddling Classic first. So it's the green tin, and then you want the yellow tin, the saddling extra for your top coat. Right, please subscribe for um, any more hints and tips. Thank you very much.